Good afternoon, Eastminster. It's Reverend Kristen Strubel here for your weekly video announcements. So for this Sunday, we're getting towards the end of our sermon series on worship. This Sunday, we're talking about music, and next Sunday, we'll be talking about blessing, the charge and benediction, and then starting a new sermon series. So music, that's been one of the hardest things, I think, about this pandemic, at least for me. Right now, I can't play in the community bell choir that I love. We're not having live performances. Our church choir isn't singing. We can't gather in the sanctuary to sing hymns together. Music is one of the ways we express our emotions and praise God. So join us as we wrestle with that topic. Last week, we had a problem with our service on Facebook. You might already know that. There was a glitch on Facebook's end, and so the worship service didn't premiere like it was supposed to. This was not our fault, and we apologize. And if this ever happens again, just switch right to YouTube. That's the great thing about having two ways to view our services. If one's not working, we can switch to another. And we do apologize for that confusion, and hopefully this week will go smoother. Our service will premiere, if all goes well, on Facebook and YouTube at 10 a.m. But as always, you can watch it anytime. I want to thank all of you who have showed up for our outdoor picnics on the church lawn. They've been wonderful. They've been wonderful, and I've enjoyed being with you. But as we know, the weather is turning. And so due to the prediction of rain and cold, we will not gather for a picnic this Sunday. Join us instead on Zoom for a virtual coffee time. I'm going to start off our Zoom time with a discussion question. And since we're talking about music and worship, let's share with each other on our coffee time first what a favorite hymn is. What's one of your favorite hymns? And then how about one of your least favorite hymns and why? We've been praying for Neil Meyer's dad, Norm, who entered hospice last week. He died peacefully last night, entering the great church triumphant. Neil is with his family right now. He has taken this week off and he's gonna take next week off to be with them. And I would ask that you please continue to hold him and the whole Meyer family in your prayers. As always, please feel free to contact me or the church, the staff with questions, needs, or concerns. Know that we are all praying for you. And I hope to see you on Sunday.